Hi there. So I've been challenged by blogger Deegan Charles Stubbs and Gazette colleague Denise Duguay to take part in the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. I find this challenge to be a ridiculous fad. It seems more about doing things, silly things for your amusement than actually supporting a charity. And yet, it's a fad that has raised millions of dollars for research and at a cost far less than the black tie galas that you read about in the papers. None of my friends currently suffers from ALS. Um, I like to keep it that way. So I'm going to be doing my part. I'll be donating $100 to the ALS Society of Quebec's Tony Proudfoot Fund in honor of the former uh, Alouette's player, broadcaster, who chronicled his fight against ALS in the Gazette. And if bringing more attention and support to the war against this incredibly douchey disease comes at the cost of a small bit of my personal dignity, that's a small price to pay. So here I am on some freshly laid grass so that there is no wasting of water for those of you haters out there. Oh my god. I emptied the ice earlier because it was a block of ice instead of little ice pellets. I didn't want to give myself a concussion. And now it is in there and it is... It is very cold. Audience here is cheering me on. Okay. It was nothing. I'm going to now challenge all of the anonymous commenting trolls on my blog, your, your Dilberts, your Steve W's, your ATSC's, your Media Man's. Hi. You have 24 hours. Throw some balls and then, um, you know, make them shrink a little bit. 